And with Kenya counting losses of up to billions of shillings from the aftermath of the floods reported across the country, the Laikipia County government has embraced the use of technology to bar flood waters from wrecking havoc. Mm, that's right. Now, the county has installed 100 movable water barriers known as slam dams along riparian areas, not only inhibiting flooding, but also ensuring water shortage to be used in the dry season. Our very own Laura Tiano now reports on the new technology that has so far given promising results across the counties. At Wiyumiriria village, a group of men are hard at work fixing pipes onto this plastic bag. The pipes are lodged into River Ngarendare, which has been steadily filling up over the last few weeks due to the enhanced rainfall witnessed in the area. These bags, lined up across a 150-meter stretch, are known as slam dams and act as a barrier to prevent flood waters from spilling over into dry land. Na hii teknolojia, uh, unatumia maji, uh, kuzui ya maji. Na hile maji tunaeka, tunaeka hapa ndani, Wakati mvua inakatika, unatumia hiyo maji kama ni kulima. Na kama ulikuwa meka maji safi, hiyo maji unaweza tumia pia kwa, kwa nyumbani. Na venye mama alisema pia, uh, slam dam inatumika kama daraja. Uh, wakati akuko maji imekuwa mingi zaidi, unaweza pitia pale juu. The slam dam technology was invented in the Netherlands where a toughened plastic bag measuring 5 meters in length, 1 meter in height and a diameter of 1.5 meters is fitted with pipes and laid across a water body. In an exercise that takes about an hour, the feeder pipes are sunk into the water body and will fill up the bag which can hold up to 8,000 liters of water once full. The dams, however, have to be deployed before the onset of the rainy season. Tulikuwa tumia identify mwaka, mwaka uliopita na county tukawafunza na sasa katika ushilikiano wa county na communities uh, wakati kumekuwa na mvua wameweza kudeploy. Kama hii islam damu ingekuwa, hii majote ikuje kwa hii boma na hii boma ingekuwa hapa. By the way, hata serikali ingefunja hii boma kwa sababu itakuwa imeatarisha maisha. Lakini kwa sababu ya islam damu, Tumeeka slam dam hapa wakati maji imekuja au familia wamekuwa safe na mpaka sasa wanatumia pia hiyo slam dam kuruka pale na kuenda pale kwa hoteli. In March of this year, the government secured a 39 billion shillings grant to support locally led climate change financing. Like Kipia County Governor Joshua Irongo indicating that he intends to spend his chunk of the money to install more of the dams as part of plans to embrace climate adaptation. For me, I see this technology beyond the prevention of the floods. During the time it is dry and we want to do water tracking, rather than all the times we are carrying the, 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 the big tanks where the communities are because of that kind of uh, nomadism, that, that movement of, uh, of the pastoral community. This is something that you can be packaged and and it is dropped to where the communities are and you are able to track water and put the water here which can be used by the community and their livestock. With Laikipia County now boasting of a water reservoir of 500,000 litres, the devolved unit is standing as the perfect example of climate adaptability by realising the silver lining in the heavy clouds of flooding to harvest water for irrigation and prevent residents from suffering the devastating effects of the raging waters. Or out here, no for Citizen Planet.